In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the downstream O2 sensors on this BMW 550i. These are going to be located underneath the vehicle next to the transmission. Let's get into it. Now we're going to remove this lower panel, use a Phillips head screwdriver, just loosen these screws up. They're going to stay with the panel. Should be another one there. Just twist it a few turns. Grab the panel, slide it back. We're gonna remove this panel in the back here. There's two Phillips head screws. We're gonna take those out. Just use a Phillips head screwdriver there and over here. Take those out. Then the rest are eight millimeters. Just use an eight millimeter socket. Back by the transmission. This shield, this center cover, we're gonna leave that. And grab the shield. And slide it out. We're gonna remove this shield next to the transmission. Use a eight millimeter socket. Take these bolts out. down. Reach up there, you can see on the side of the transmission where the connector is clipped in. Just try to pop that out of the clip. There's another retainer over here as well. Just push that up. Disconnect the connector. I'm just using some hose pliers and grab the end. Just make sure you hold it. You don't want to. You don't want to pull the wires. And just disconnect it. Makes it a little easier. And using a O2 sensor socket. This is a 7/8 or a 22 with a slice in it, so you can go over the wire. We'll loosen it up. Crack it free. Normally it's pretty easy to just loosen it by hand and take it out. And slide it out. Take the O2 sensor. Just get it started by hand. Now we're gonna to torque this to 36 foot-pounds. And just line the connector up and plug it in. Make sure it locks down in place. Just squeeze it. Looks like it's all the way down. and run the wires 
up, find the clip up a little higher. Put the connector in the clip, and then there's a retainer for the wires just to keep them away from the exhaust. That's good right there. I'm gonna take this shield, get this lined up, get the bolts started. down. And you can do the same on the other side. I'll put this panel up, get this lined up. I'll get some of these started. This back one had a Phillips head screw. Phillips head screw on the back. and tighten these all down. Snug those down, put this panel up, get it lined up. And take a Phillips head screwdriver, and get the screws started. twist. That's good. And the rest of the panel. Now that was a quick and easy job, and you're back on the road. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.